I always said, or always will say, is that if you look long enough, you will find the beauty. I know as a child I used to collect bones. We lived in the country and when we'd go walking you would find little skeletons of things. And so therefore I sort of had a collection of small bones. They are the kind of certificate of what it is to be human. I started to um, see if I could go photograph bones in museums, but I didn't want to go into the place where they put them all together. Like, you know, you go to the Natural History Museum and they've got the dinosaurs and they've got the monkeys and they've got everybody. I just wanted to go into the, uh, the back room, so to speak, and see them. And so then on several museums, they allowed me to do it. It wasn't easy. They weren't so happy to do it, but they finally did. And then I just got and, and completely in love with bones. <laughs> I had to say to myself, this is not going to be like the platinum prints, but it's going to be something beautiful. I wanted to do something special about them. I didn't quite know what. And I started to experiment with um, doing platinum prints. And uh, I have this fantastic assistant, um, Fabian, and he's just extraordinary human being. And he did a lot of research and taught me a lot. He had never done it before either, so we both started printing with the platinum. And it's a very, very, very delicate process because the slightest thing can go wrong. And even, you know, for instance, in the paper, there can be a little imperfection, you know, a little black dot that comes out of you don't know where, or all kinds of things can go wrong. One chemical doesn't act the same that it did before. So it's quite a fascinating process and beautiful, I think. Gerhardt and I worked really hard to make it. Well, he's a genius, so he was able to really make what I wanted. So I'm really pleased. And he came up with a beautiful way, I'll show it to you, that he put this little, not gold, but a little almost like copper thing around the images that gave them another kind of honor. I hope that my work will lead you to explore other things that maybe you might first find not interesting or you might be frightened of or you might not want to address. But each time you go into this unknown place, I think you're rewarded. I do.